Hi everyone, I just wanted to share um, my tag that I made for a swap on the Totally Tilda Facebook group. Um, we had, there were a total of nine of us and um, that swapped tags, and of course they had to be Tilda um, inspired. So I, let's get it close up here, I did use the corner shop um, paper and cut out the cakes. And then I added some stickles. I think it was platinum is what I want to say. And then I had this, um, I think it's Meyer Road ribbon or trim. It's kind of plastic with a little bit of iridescence to it. And then some millinery flowers, some pink trim from Hobby Lobby. And I think this was on one of those little spools that you get like about 15 little tiny spools in a package at um, Marshalls or TJ Maxx. And then the little um, flower with rhinestone I had ordered off eBay, as well as the bow. And then the little flowers, um, Nancy Martinez had, or was it Lisa? Can't remember who, <laughs> but they are little clay flowers that for nail art. And they're just perfect on little tags and things for little projects. So I have those. And let's see here. Um, this is, let's see here, Yolores 07. And this is hers. Oh, it's gorgeous. I hope I said her name right. Oh, I want to learn. I want to learn how to make that flower. Love. Look at that. She's stickled. Love my stickles. And it says, thinking of you every day in her little bag. Isn't that cute? cute? And here's our bag. Oh, there's the tag. Oh, look how adorable. And I think that stickles. She's got a leaf and a little pin in there and a little bottle cap. Very cute. And some flowers. And this is um, Sharon. Finkbeiner, and I'm probably saying her name wrong. It's really cute. Thank you so much. I'm trying to figure out all that. I really like how she put that in there. It's really cute. Very, very cute. And then she sent some goodies. Oh, I love these flowers. Thank you so much. And some bling and pearls. That's really neat. A little piece of paper and a blank tag. How nice. Thank you so much. She's got some buttons and the flowers and ribbon. Thank you so much. Let's see, try to keep it all straight here. I like that color of the blue. That's really pretty. And, oh, that's pretty too. Everybody, it's amazing. This is from Yvonne Letford. I'm going to try not to paper card that way. Oh, so pretty. If I can get it out of the bag. Sorry, guys. Well, there we go. Oh, it's very pretty. It's like a little wooden butterfly. It's a little little um just little iridescent pearls some flowers a pretty trim and then some i don't know if you can see the pearl trim and then it looks like some glittered paper and she's cut out a tilde image and i'm going to assume glossy accents and maybe some stickles that turned out really nice i think i need to get some new glossy accents i tried to use it and it I don't know, it just didn't dark. It didn't work right, but I've had it forever. So I don't know if it can become old or not. It's very pretty. Thank you. Oh my goodness. Ooh, pretty, pretty, pretty. They just oh, they're all so pretty. And this is from Natasha Griffin. And she is Griffin Girl on YouTube. Oh, she's my favorite trim. And she's covered it with the tilde paper, and it looks like a heart doily, and then the tilde image. And then I love how she made the little frame and the little flower and put the, like, a 
need a picture in there. And I love this trim. I go through a lot of trim. So pretty. And the bling will swirl. And once again, that is from Griffin Girl on YouTube. And on Facebook, it's Natasha Loves Paper and Glitter. What a cute name. Okay. Oh, the cherub. This is from Lisa. Rexel, I think is what it says. Oh, so cute. So, cherub, and she stickled the roses and then put some flat back pearls and some trim. And then at the top. So cute. And it looks like, I think that's the Martha Stewart punch, but I could be wrong. Uh, and this one is um, Emma Hicks. Isn't that cute? And she, well, apparently it's winter. I'm assuming winter. I can't think of the paper. And it looks, I don't know if she made the background paper or not. It looks like she might have. It's really pretty. And then she's got lace over here, but it looks like she may have chalked or glimmer misted the paper. It's really pretty. I don't know if the camera's picking up the depth or not. It's really cute and looks like some stickles. Can never go wrong with stickles. And then she has a couple little um, gemstones and a little heart. Cute. Ooh. And then this one, cute little bag and a rosette. And a button. Love the big buttons. Okay. Oh, and this is from Ms. Lisa from Lisa's Paper Passion. Love her stamp. How cute is that? Oh, I love it. And she has it. I'm pretty sure it's Glimmer Misted the Paper. And it's a dress form. I'm trying to see if you can pick it up. But is that not the cutest? It's the dress form. And then she's got, you know, for the top the bow and then a little resin piece. And then she used a doily to make the skirt. Love it. And then a doily. You know, she's cut a doily in half. A doily. I can't talk. A doily in half. And then some a trim with um, pearls. Love it, Lisa. Thank you so much. They're all so pretty. I can't wait to get them all together and hang them, hang them up. Here. I'm missing a tag, so I'm not sure. Natasha, okay. Um, this is so cute. Hi, friend. Here's a place to jot it all down. You're totally terrific notes. Love Natasha. Is that not cute? What a cute note. I'm not good at, at writing notes like that, so <laughs> I'm always. Oh, there's goodies that have fallen out of the box, of the, the bag, so I'm not sure. I do apologize. I'm not sure who. who um, who this came with. Card. Oh. oh, thank you, Lisa. Thank you for hosting the swap. Really appreciate it. Oh, look at this happiness inside. Is that not cute or what? Oh, I love that. I can't find any of the big paper clips. So cute. Love the fabric. Love it, love it, love it. And then, oh, I've never seen one of these with a cork before. Cute. Oh, my. Let me see if I can get it. There we go. Maybe. Get it untied. <laughs> dun dun. Okay. Well, so thank you for the extra goodies. I'm just not sure how, where, who sent them, but thank you very much. Oh, my goodness. Oh, look at that frame. That's gorgeous. How pretty. And I love it. Oh, love the strand. Oh, look, and they, they made a rosette. Love that. Love those little metal pieces, the little hanger. It's really cute. Thank you. You put it on, on just anything. Look at the little wooden dress form. Oh, I've got to make a mold of that little cute little cherub face. Adorable. And then. I need to get this punch. I think this is the EK Success punch. And I love the paper. Okay. Oh, here's another tag. Pretty. Love her 
bling up there. So she it looks like she's pop dotted a picture and then some trim and flowers. And this is from Christine. Isn't that pretty? So pretty, Christine. Thank you. Ladies, these are just all so gorgeous. And it, I cannot wait to get them displayed. I'll have to, I'll take a picture and I will put it on the Facebook group. But aren't those gorgeous? It's just amazing um, how everybody um, just comes together for a swap. And um, it's just amazing what you learn. And um, for me, the friendships that you develop. And I just feel very blessed um, to have met some wonderful crafters um, and chatted with them on Facebook. And I just... Like I said, I feel very blessed. I've met some wonderful ladies and um, just so caring and um, just wonderful. But thank you, ladies. The tags are gorgeous. Um, and have a great day. Thank you. Bye-bye.